Hey Beto, I'm gonna be honest, I thought you were gonna fall in the ditch. Nah, bro. Nah, that was bad. My business is smoking more. Hey, rocks. Hey, pocket full of motherfucking blue. What's up YouTube, welcome back to On The Gas Show. We are back with another video and today is the day that we're picking up the 2020 Duramax. What is it, a giveaway? If we're giving it away or we're not, Frank? It's a future giveaway. Yes. Future giveaway is gonna be a two week giveaway once we're done doing the starlights. And I know I said I was gonna delete the truck, but unfortunately, we do not wanna get in trouble with the laws. We heard that the Diesel Brothers, the guys out there in Utah, they got in trouble for giving away deleted trucks. And since we're pretty big on YouTube, bro. People get in trouble for having it in California or whatever, and we don't wanna get involved Yes, we do not want to get involved with that. So we're still adding a programmer on the truck. We are adding a cold air intake as well. It will for sure wake it up a little bit. It gives it like 100 horsepower and 100 pounds of torque. I know my boy Tito has it on his white Denali and I know he's way faster than Tiny and then the black Denali. We are going to be taking that truck to STP once we're done here. My boys at STP are going to be adding the tune and of course the cold air intake so it can breathe a little bit better. Right now we're right here with boy Speedy. We are picking up finally the 2020 Duramax. We added Starlights. We are also brought the current giveaway that we got right now because we are gonna add some nice touches to the seats on this one i'm gonna talk to my boy speedy see if we can do something here maybe just wrap the whole new seat again bro i don't like this you don't like this little two-tone leather i mean what is that i don't know it doesn't look bad but we're gonna have to switch it out also we got the starter pack truck seats here in the back we are dropping these off with my boy speedy we're gonna do some black leather and red stitching if y'all guys see the truck behind me it just looks like the starter pack truck that we got going on right now that one does have 26 514s on 35 and it has a nice lift kit i know y'all gonna say we need to go that size but if we do the same thing then we're gonna copy that dude right yeah so i mean it's kind of hard to go that route yeah. Yeah. We got especially after seeing it yes we got some jtx wheels coming shout out to my boy chris at jtx he is hooking me up with some nice wheels for that truck they're gonna expedite the wheels supposedly we're gonna get them in two weeks so we got some nice wheels for that truck like y'all stay tuned we are putting a sound system right now at manny's that's why we got the seats right now we are doing some color matching as we speak we're adding some headers exhaust kind of like the exhaust that we added to perrillo's truck yesterday besides that he got smoke Where's he at right now, bro? Where's Perrillo at? So we were actually worried because we haven't heard from Alex. He was a no car, no show. He didn't pull up to the shop. So we've been looking for him. He was, I'm worried. I'm calling everybody. Nobody knows nothing. His single cab, the truck that we bought him, La 420, ain't at the shop. I was like, all right, this guy is not answering his phone. This guy's probably in jail, bro. Well, come to find out he's sick. He's at home, chilling. He didn't even bother to text me or nothing. A simple text, Alex, would have hurt nobody, bro. <laughs> Anyways, right here, Speedy Headliners. I see that the giveaway is inside. The 2020 Duramax is inside. Let's go check it out, see how it looks. What's up, bro? All right, so we're right here, Speedy Headliners. If y'all seen the past giveaways that we had, this is my guy right here. He's been doing our interior here for a couple of seats already, a couple, a couple of times. Couple cars we in. did the white SS clone. We did lifted single cab. The black lifted single cab. The red OBS. The, the red the OBS. Two OBSs actually. The blue one or two red OBSs. Two red and the blue one. The blue one. Wow, five we've done more. <laughs> I thought it was like a couple. It was like five trucks. Five, yeah. six trucks. And then this one. this one. And then of course the starter pack giveaway seats. I brought them. And then I brought the current giveaway that we got Ooh. right now. I want you to check it out. We're gonna add some sauce to that. But first is first, we got the 2020 Duramax here. We had a giveaway on this one. The guy took the money. We got to keep the truck for a little longer. We are adding some stuff. And one of the mods that we added is Starlights. Please show us how it looks. Yeah. So we're gonna go ahead and we black out all the pillars. So be the two front ones, the middle ones, and the back ones. We're gonna go ahead and add it uh, 1100 stars. We blacked out all the visors, suede headliner, and everything is app controlled. So I'll go ahead and show you. Yeah. So once you open the app, it should connect automatically. Like I say, it's all it's all app controlled. We also have a controllers, which would be a lot easier. And then go ahead and turn it off, turn it on, and you have a switch right here as well. Oh, okay. Oh, we cool. want to go ahead and blend it in with the rest of the ones okay. that you have. Get to use the controller. So there it is. I feel like I'm on a worse works, bro. I mean, we did this one to the single cab, the black one that we had, right? We did that yeah, to the single cab, yeah. yeah the black yeah. one. But this one just feels different just because it's a four door. I don't know, bro. <laughs> when you go out, when you party this weekend or what? It feels like I'm in a Rolls Royce. The coolest part about this is that we have a remote. You know, we can change the colors. Do we have a switch where it changes colors automatically? Yeah, so this one you have the Fate 7, so it'll change different colors. Oh, also. by itself. Mm -hmm. yeah, there you go. Can you dim it down too? Or yeah, is... you can dim it down. So here on the top, you have, let's say, we go with a blue. You can go ahead and bring it down with this and if you think it's too bright. Oh. And then start dimming down, dimming down, dimming down. You can also do it with, with the phone. You say once you have the app, it'll be a lot easier. Okay. So like, oh. you can bring it up, you can bring it down. Oh, down. okay. Light. Yeah, the only the cool thing about the phone is you can make your actually your own custom color and stuff. Oh, That's okay. That's the best part of it. 
Fuck yeah. And you have different options. You have your sound mode as well. Where you can show like the frequencies, like all kinds of stuff. All kinds of stuff. There's a different option that you have. Not only did you put the lights, but you also put a black suede all the way. You painted all this black, all the plastics. Yeah, all the plastics and trims. The sun visors are wrapped in suede as well. All these panels are black now, so that's pretty cool. Now it actually looks a little darker in here. Darker than Alex. <laughs> You know, my boy Alex is not here today. He's, I feel bad for the guy. He's sick. He's He has a sore throat. I hope he doesn't have COVID. I told him to go get tested today. But yeah, this is pretty nice. I mean, these lights made a big difference. So this truck, once we're done with it, once we have the tune and the cold air intake, if y'all didn't have a chance to purchase it on the last giveaway, y'all make sure to enter this giveaway. It's going to be a sick giveaway. We ain't doing no cash option. This truck has to go. No more money. This truck has to go. You know, last time it wasn't for that guy. It wasn't meant to be. It you know, now it's going to go to the right owner, someone who actually yes. wants the truck. Yes. This is actually the last time that we did the giveaway on this one that's the first time they take the money they always take the truck so that's what i'm saying it wasn't for that guy that guy he needed that money more he was gonna buy a house he's gonna put a down payment on the house but this time when it comes around it's gonna be the right guy and i hope you take care of it because frank took care of it yeah it's really well taken care of it's immaculate brand new really it's brand new man it's fucking hot in here how do you know you have 1100 stars you guys count them so the kit it's one smoke projector but it has two strands and each one has 550 oh. so it's every single one so it has to be so one by it, one. One by one. One by one. It doesn't have to be, but we make sure all of them go in. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah they're smaller kits. You have anywhere from like a 300, you have a thousand kit, and it keeps going up and up and up depending uh, on what you want. But that looks perfect. You know, it's, it's just not too just, many. It's not too many. Nah, nah, yeah. it, it looks just good. All right, come on, Sackers. I'm gonna show you some. Yeah, full full red interior. Full red interior. It looks kind of rough right now. Up, but we're gonna go ahead and take oh, okay, okay, yeah. Yeah, we're gonna uh, new door panels. I would take all of the new seats. Or to fabricate a brand new center console. We actually have a truck just like this one called the Starter Pack, but it's a lifted Z71 edition. And we are adding big wheels, big tires. It already has like a. It's not too big of a lift, right? No, it's minor. Like. And yeah, this is probably like a nine. But we are adding big wheels. We are color matching. This one just looks like the Starter Pack. And we brought the seats because we are gonna get these things wrapped. So we got a 2000 model starter pack truck giveaway kind of like i was just saying right now these are the seats that i was talking about mm -hmm. so they're not in too bad of a conditions black leather black leather red stitching okay we're gonna see but you want to go black or black red black black, black. black. yeah yeah let's so go ahead and make cover for this one and everything okay um add a little bit of design but nothing too crazy. Do you want to keep the same cuts? Okay. I don't know. Just do something. But I don't want too much. Okay. You know, do something sporty. I got you. I don't want diamonds. Not on diamonds. I don't want squares. <laughs> do if you go and do some lines, do like a, another line here with we'll, this we'll one. Do, we'll do something different. I'll, I'll do something yeah. different on it. Something simple, not too much going on, but something black leather, red stitching. Yeah. Red stitching. Now, do you want your your logo right here or on the headrest? Wherever you want to. Whatever is easier for you. No matter. Okay. We're gonna put on the gas edition. Not like the other people was in the past. So I'll go ahead and paint the frames as well because they're pretty. Yeah, so this interior is blue. It's bluish. Mm, it's kind of like a charcoal. It's like a charcoal, yeah. But once we add black, they're gonna be black, black. What about these plastics? Are they gonna get wrapped? So um, if you go ahead, I'll show you the ones inside. Yeah, all these get sanded down and they all get wrapped from. This one gets actually painted, this one gets painted, but all the other plastics get wrapped. Okay. Well, so they won't get scuffed or anything like that. Your well, panels are charcoal? It's still this color. So the only thing is, if we go black, the art's going to stand out. What we can do is we can go back to the same factory color if you want. Okay, we'll do factory color, rest factory, stitching. Yeah, so it's a very dark beater. We'll go ahead and match it up to the plastic and trim. So that way you don't have to do the rest of the interior. Yeah, so, uh, we'll go ahead and blend it in. They're actually the center console. We're adding a center console just kind of like on that one. And they are wrapping the center console. I think I might like, have one. Let me see if I can bring it over. This seat is uh, black. It's actually like a charcoal gray. So if we do black, black, and then the center console is not going to be black, and then the door panels are not going to be black. They're going to be this color. It's going to look ugly. It's going to look like we found them on another truck yeah. and put them on there. It's not going to flow. Yeah, you got to match everything, make everything look nice. It's a really nice truck, though. I keep looking at it. It really is. It kind of looks like the other giveaway that we had, but the older, older version. Yeah, because older had, brother. Older brother, yeah, because we had big wheels. We have little tires like that, you know, thin tires. It was a red suspension lift kit. I mean, it kind of looks like it, yeah. So we do have got some wheels coming from JTX. So y'all stay tuned for that. It's going to be some badass wheels. Hopefully, we get it done in two weeks so we can get that thing going. Nice one's actually a little bit darker. This one's, yeah, it's a little more blue. You see the blue? It looks a little blue now. You mentioned it, I do see it. Yeah, because this is gray. That's gray, yeah. And that's a little blue. Yeah, so this one, they started using this in 03 and up. 03 and up, that one's, yeah, 99 02. Okay, well then, if we add red, it's gonna look funny. Just make them white or gray stitching. Gray? Yeah. It's gonna look white. The only thing is, it's gonna get dirty really It's quick. gonna get dirty, yeah. It's gonna get dull, like a light gray. Is that type? Black. It's black. It's uh, just like that one. It's literally identical to this. <laughs> yeah, Except, yeah. Okay, okay, okay. I mean, we can still go with red. 
I don't feel like they'll be the problem. You want me to bring the rest of the team out? I think it's going to look funny. I don't know. And then once you're done, they're done, bro. You know, you yeah, can't. There ain't no going back. Yeah, it ain't going back. See, like, these are black. But everything is darker on this newer model truck. So it flows good. It flows good. Yeah, and then it matches the center console. It has a little bit of lighter gray here. But this is a dark gray, isn't it? Or is it black? That's like a dark gray. Dark gray. Yeah, it's all dark gray. So if we do add gray stitching, it'll look like this. That looks nice. Yeah, let's just do that. For this one, it would be nice to put like a small strip of blue too. But that'll be too much. No, it'll be nice. Yeah, right? Yeah. Like somewhere around. Or maybe the on the gas edition be that blue. blue Turquoise, yeah, whatever teal color yeah. it is. Blue and uh, gray. Yeah. So white will look cool. But like I said, the only issue is that it will get dirty. Red's going to stand out the most. I don't think it'll look bad. You don't think so? Nah. The only thing is if you go gray and black, it'll kind of blend in. You won't be able to see it. So honestly, I would go between these two. Or we can go with both. Remember how the black one that we did? The single cap? We went to go ahead and added both of them. It was one in and one out. So it'll be like this one right here. Let me open it up. It has white and red, if I'm not mistaken. Oh. So we can do it like that. So we can do the double stitch outside. We can do one red and one white. That's the way we did the single cap. That was it, 2018? Yeah. That's the way we did that Okay, one. I go ahead and do this. And on this one, you want to change up the seats. So we bought this truck and this is our current giveaway right now. Every $10 you spend, we'll get you one entry. We do got some shirts coming up and we do got some stickers coming up. It will give you multiple entries for this giveaway. September 18th is the deadline. We bought this truck just like this. It has, you know, custom wheels, supercharger. It's already kind of dumb, bro. But we want to add some sauce. And the only way to do that without fucking everything else is change the seats. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. So it does have custom leather seats already. It does have a custom center console, but we need to change it up a little bit. Okay, so what we can do definitely black out the top half. Yes. Black out the top half. Um, if you want to do, I feel like I can. I'm, I have to check it out. We can probably leave the seats like that if we want to, but we can probably change the seat books in a color like this. I will have to take a look into it though. Yes. But if we can definitely the seats. I like this color a lot, but I don't know if you want to add it to it. Yeah, we wrap the seat and then Frank was talking about the stitching, adding the a stitching, little bit. Yeah, yes. the stitching on that we color. We got a really nice color though. Yeah. This and gray. Mm -hmm. You know, on the yeah. gas condition right here, mm -hmm. and then add a little bit of stitching all the way around the seat. Black seat. You know what I'm saying? Black, yeah, black seat. But you want to go with this color stitching, right? Yes. Yeah, that's yes. gonna sound a lot. Yes. So um, other than that, probably just the door inserts. Yeah. These are fine. You can use the door inserts. So just schedule me this one in. So whenever you got a little bit of time, remember we do have a deadline for this truck. It's September 18th, so it'll have to be here pretty soon. Be soon. Yeah. You can just black all this out. Seats. Do the door panels. It has a little sound system. I'm gonna leave it like that. Okay. This one. I don't know if you wanna do it, but this looks pretty badass with ambient. Yeah. It's just easy anything on it. Okay. Look, I mean, it's in those AC vents and the radio bezel. Just with that, I'll show you a picture right now, and I look really sick. Paint it. Ah, uh, no. So they're gonna be the ambient lighting so we'll take a look here oh the ones for um for, i don't know static dead one and we did a couple other ones yeah. that they have. So this goes around the vents. Yeah, so this goes around the vents. You can put this in the door trim. So you can show them this one so you can get a rough idea what it looks like. One, you can hit the light. Oh, yeah. You go ahead and mess around with it. Mm. So, these, like I said, you can tell right off the bat, these are a lot brighter than the first ones they put on them. On the other ones, we stopped using them, I think, after the second time. And then they offered me these, and these are actually a lot better. There's that blue that has the Katana pin strap, no? Mm -hmm. Yeah, right there. And you can do it. It also has like a camouflage theme. So, let me see. So, you go in this camera right here. And you can make your uh, choose your own custom color. So this, for this is red. It'll make it. Oh. Deep. So you can just blend in and stuff like yeah, that. Depending on the lighting that it has. Cool. So if you turn the light, it actually get brighter and stuff like that. And it also has different modes where you can choose like speed and stuff. So let's say you turn your GPS on, and depending how fast you're going, it's how bright it's gonna get. Oh. So if you're at a red light, it'll be like dead. If you start speeding up, it'll start getting brighter and brighter and brighter. So this is different modes that it has. I wish you guys go really fast. <laughs> Get the brightest. Yeah. And then this one, you can just have like the, the change colors. The change and stuff colors. Like that. Yeah. Okay. That's different options. This is. Like I said, this is by far one of the best ambient lines that we have. There yeah. All right, so we're going to be using this on the giveaway. Yeah, same thing. You can go ahead and dim it down if you think it's too bright because it might not seem as bright when you're driving it. Is yeah, yeah, once you it got really dark bright. ass tint mm -hmm. and then everything's dark in there. And if you have Alex with you, you probably are not going to see it. <laughs> but with this light, you can probably see them. Nada más los dientillos, huh? Yeah. Starter pack seats, they're gonna be black or the original color with the red and, and white two tone stitch on the gas, mm -hmm. on the headrest or whatever. What do you have done for the headline or anything like that? Is it just a stock one? Is it good or? Uh, it's gonna be, me lo están haciendo ya, pero va a ser negro. Okay, so they have the, like, ammo, like, the like, speaker on top or? They're just wrapping it with the same, the same material thing? Same material that it has, but black um, or the dark color. The dark color, okay. So they're gonna blend it in? Yeah, blend okay, it in, yeah, yeah. So I need the seats. I don't know if you wanna touch the door panels. Depending on how 
condition there, we can probably just do the armrest itself. Okay. That way it can look like the ones on the on the ramp. Okay. Just to blend it in. Just to blend it in. That's probably not it. That's probably the only thing you really have to do. Once it's done there, I can actually bring it over here, drop it off, and so you can do the door panels. Do you have to take off the whole door panel? Uh, yeah. And then you're gonna install the seats, and then we can take it from there. Mm -hmm. And then you're gonna schedule me in for the current giveaway that we got right now. So September 18 is the deadline, so something before that, like way before that, so we can actually no, yeah, pimp yeah. it out. Load it and stuff like that. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I got you, I got you. So now, uh, another question that I have, do you want to go ahead and paint the plastics as well? Like the vents and stuff, or do you just want to do this ambient lighting? What color are you going to paint them? Uh, we will try to paint them as close as we can to the... If you have the paint coat, we can match up the paint coat to the actual paint I don't have the paint coat. That's, so, the, that's the bad thing about it. Yeah. Did we can get it? To that truck? Yeah, if you can get it, we can go ahead and order it, and we'll, we'll paint them the same. So this is this one we went with the High Country one uh -huh. from the 2020s. So that's the color you run with this one. And it also blends in with the seats and stuff. So it's pretty cool. So it'll give you that, that contrast. It won't it won't just be regular black. So like I said, we can go ahead and add the same patterns down the seats uh, and we can go like that. And then this one will be painted to match the trims as well. What if we paint the vents charcoal gray instead of blue? We can paint them charcoal gray. That, that, that's oh that's the color I was thinking of painting. Oh, okay, yeah, okay. Charcoal gray, charcoal gray. Yeah, if we put them blue, it's going to be too bright. Yeah, it's too much. It's too, too much. much. Yeah. Yeah. Right. But you can do the blue will be just the uh, ambient light. I'm probably sure we can probably get the gray. Oh, it might be the original gray. Yeah, that's that's what I was thinking it might be. What we can do is just take up the gas tap and... So originally the truck was gray. Mm -hmm. They just re-sprayed it with and the, the graphic. Yeah. 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 You yeah. said yeah. take off the gas cap? You can take off the gas cap and I can go send it, it out. It doesn't have one. <laughs> oh, it doesn't have one. It has a fuel cell in the back. In the back. I just... Yeah. So ya no tiene el... Ta shaped in. Yeah. Where's Ryan? If you're watching this, Ryan, hit us up. We're looking for the color code. It's probably going to be original. If we paint those, we should uh, we probably paint the ones in the steering wheel as well. Just go ahead and take care of them. Just to match everything. Just yeah. to match everything up. Okay. So it'll yeah, be the same setup as this right here. So my phone, like to hear that everything's going to be taken care of. Oh, no, bro, he knows how to talk. <laughs> hey, Beto, I'm gonna be honest, I thought you were gonna fall in the ditch. Nah, bro. Nah, that was badass. That was, that was good, badass. I'm good, I'm good. That was badass. Alright, guys, so we just left Speedy Shop. We're gonna head over to STP Diesel, but it's getting kinda late. The guys are about to leave already from the shop. So we're gonna save it for another day. The Starlights came out pretty sick. I haven't had a chance to really mess with it yet. I don't even know if they're turned up all the way or if they're just dim, but it looks really cool. It looks really nice. The pillars came out good. It's a darker color now. It used to be like a light gray. Now it's like a darker gray, kind of black. Kind of blends now with this. I wish GM came out with it this way from OEM, from the dealer, instead of having to get it customized. The suede is pretty nice on the sun visors. It feels really soft. It feels really nice. So that's it for today, guys. Make sure you like, subscribe, and do all that cool stuff don't forget the 2014 giveaway that is ongoing right now so tomorrow's gonna be a really cool day so make sure you're subscribed we're actually heading out of town to get an update on a cool vehicle that a lot of people have been asking about i don't want to give out too many details i don't want to spoil it it's gonna be a really cool episode this place is actually pretty popular it's pretty famous some of you may already know what i'm talking about some of you may not but make sure to like subscribe and do all that cool shit we'll catch you on the next one